Hi everybody, it's Galactic Man Larry here again with another Masterverse action figure review and today we have in front of us from Masters of the Universe Revelation the Sorceress or just Sorceress and there you can see her looking great in the window uh, here you have artwork that looks amazing again uh, please let me know the name of the artist and this one which is even cooler and I guess more representative of the Sorceress there you have the rest of the way we have done everyone else so far uh, legal stuff more legal stuff sorceress masterverse let's just take her out of the packaging and see how good she actually is and there you have the sorceress out of the packaging and looking great there you can see she comes only with her staff and a couple of extra hands but still I think it's a really good looking figure these are the two extra hands she came with both creeping hands attached and she came with two extra you know like spell casting hands uh, on the packaging this is the staff i don't know if it has a specific name if it does please leave it down there in the comment section it's all cast in white plastic and it just has this kind of simple sculpt which actually looks pretty nice and yeah it's well achieved she well there you can see her face sorry about the shadows you know the lightning situation my place here in mexico um yeah a very nice face sculpt a very nice head dress or whatever this is called um the if you remove the head let's see if we can do that on camera yeah you can also remove this piece which the whole yeah, which the whole cape is attached to, so I won't really remove it for now because I don't want to take the whole cape off. But uh, she came out of the packaging without the bands attached to her arms and it was a bit of a pain to put it on, well, to put them on. And I have her in a pose now, but uh, once you do it, it's, it's okay. The only thing I'm, I don't like is that if you do a fully stretched pose, let's see if I can show you this thing starts to yeah to stretch and it doesn't look properly it doesn't look nice let's say actually I'm, I'm not even able to to do it on camera somehow there you can see it, it stretches all the way and that's not the way it should be i guess or i think at least but it's the way it is that's the number one gripe i have with the figure maybe the the only real gripe i have i mean the solution with these elastic bands, it's okay, but you know these things can give off, uh, you know, after a couple of years they might be all toasted and uh, crinkly and overstretched and broken, you know, uh, that would be a shame. I mean, if you play with the figure, definitely, if you just stand her there and you have nice weather, not so hot where you live then it will survive but otherwise it will suffer um yeah well that's how it looks like on the back also a gripe that i have is that this the ends of the cape just yeah that happens and you cannot see the cape properly um but yeah well th those are the my first world problems i have with this figure otherwise you can see the diaphragm can look backwards that far she can look forward quite a lot i must say i mean for one single diaphragm joint is is nice and there you have some turning around i guess the legs let's see because i'm yeah you can turn the whole waist below this kind of dress piece gown whatever uh, the arms can go all the way around i won't do it now because i have the cape attached but they could go all the way around but of course you have this feather uh, kind of armor thingy and it's yeah that will get in the way so i mean this is of course this will be a more static character the sorceress like well she's the sorceress and she's not doing the martial arts moves i would say i mean you can but i mean not with the cape on um i mean it's your imagination you can do whatever she, you, you want she has double jointed pinless elbows that can bend all the way i don't know if i want to show you on camera because i would have to crush the thing but yeah i mean they can bend all the way i'll leave it there for now to not to squeeze the the elastic bands the head can turn all the way around 
of course it will be a bit uh, hard with the whole thing she has on going up and down looking up and down is hindered by the shape of the white headdress but well at least you can bend with the diaphragm and you can do a bit forward but it, you know the next with master verse don't always cooperate properly hands are all with horizontal swivels two gripping hands two uh, spell casting hands you know the drill bicep swivel the shoulders i told you and she can lift up to a t-pose but this thing will get in the way um the diaphragm we saw it the legs can do they will be hindered by this plastic kind of dress thing again is the sorceress you should i mean you should do whatever you want but i mean it's a yeah she's meant to be more like if you're playing canon wise she's not like the martial artist but the legs can lift up to there before it start to get starts to get troublesome she can kick kicking backwards is hindered by the crotch piece or the you know pelvis you have a thigh cut double jointed knees that can bend i would say all the way but the dress gets in the way she has a boot cut she has the feet that can bend backwards all the way forward a decent amount and she has an ankle rocker and for size comparisons there you have the sorceress next to roboto and pig head looking great and next to frosta shadow weaver and andra i think the sorceress is a great figure just the cape solution in her case is really it's a bit cheap you know i mean these three have a cheap cape you know but the shadow weaver i think is the one well andra and shadow weaver are the ones which have a bit i mean the cape was well resolved and in this case it's a bit like could be could have been better as well as with frost i guess but uh here is more crucial because it's part of her you know main appeal things you know these her like wings cape whatever and yeah that definitely doesn't work as wings but as some sort of very flimsy cape in any case i still like the figure and to have her pose standing there and whatever it will do but it could be much better definitely in any case it's up to you if you want to have the figure i think she still looks very nice i mean the face and all of that is nice please leave a like share comment subscribe take care and i will see you in the next one ciao ciao ciao